the ugly truth coming to you live from Queens Park. It's Saturday, May the 7th, 2011. I'm here at the Freedom Festival with a couple of friends. Uh, looks like there's going to be a real huge march in support of uh, marijuana. I'm here not necessarily condone the use of marijuana to anybody. Um, however, I do feel that it should be legalized considering uh, if you compare its effects to alcohol, which is legal, uh, all the money that's uh, spent and wasted on uh, fighting the drug war, which is a losing battle. Um, there's more and more medical uses being uh, discovered every day uh, that show that this is truly a natural uh, healing medicinal plant. And of course, as Dave was saying, if you can't patent it and there's no profit in it, they want to make it illegal so they can sell you their synthetic drugs. And, and that is the ugly truth. We're at the uh, Toronto Freedom Festival, marijuana merch to show our support. We're here to, we want it legalized. It's a medicinal plant and the only reason it's illegal is because of pharmaceutical companies, they can't patent life to the plant, so they don't want you to be able to heal yourself. So they want us to use toxic medications that kill us slowly. I'd rather kill myself slowly with the drug of my own choosing. <laughs> Peace. It really is. It's, it's a harmless, harmless drug, and it's only been criminalized, I think, because of initially it was Mexican smoking. It. So there was like a, a big anti-immigrant thing in the states, and they came up with banning it, right? And it, because yeah. it wasn't the white man's drug, it was made illegal as opposed to tobacco and uh, and grain and alcohol, which is you know. All farm industry. I mean, that's a huge cash crop. I've seen it on YouTube. I know it's true. Stephen Harper just won a majority government. In the next 100 days, he is going to introduce laws that will see many of you put in prison. How many of you smoke pot? How many of you grow pot? Yeah, baby.